investigation into a possible super spreader event at the Wuhan military games in October 2019. Here to discuss Ohio Representative Warren Davidson. October 2019 is when the games happened. This tweet from one of the athletes who participated was May of 2020. We're going to pop it up on the screen. It basically says, you know, we all felt sick. A large number of us felt really sick. So that timeline, October 2019, May 2020, why are we just hearing about this in June of 2021? Yeah, why indeed? I mean, if you look at what's going on inside China, uh, they've refused to cooperate. And uh, not only this news, but just yesterday's news about um, the, the request to delete uh, gene sequencing from uh, lab samples uh, from the wet market. So you look at uh, the results there. Uh, I just shared a tweet about it. Uh, that That's worth looking into. And frankly, it's been suppressed, uh, not just by the media, but by many in the scientific community. Why is that? What's your understanding of these deleted samples, this report that just came out? Uh, well, that they don't match the, the theory. They're different uh, and, frankly, uh, merit further investigation. The good news is that we gained access to them. Uh, the paper that came out uh, hasn't yet been peer reviewed, but it looks like we have um, access to samples that were requested to be deleted. Uh, and were uh, they were recovered from a cloud um, backup, right. and they don't match previous samples. So you look at um, all the efforts China's made to suppress an actual honest investigation into the causes. Uh, we really do need a, the global community to put pressure onto China uh, to cooperate. And frankly, we're just going to have to conduct our own independent analysis. And it's time for scientists to use actual science, not political science. Uh, and to me, that's why I sponsored the FIRED Act. It's Dr. Fauci right. needs to go. It's been his job to lead some of this. He's been in place since 1984. Uh, he's been very ineffective, and it's time for new leadership there. You hit the nail right on the head. How many more of these leaks? We have one per week now. How many more before we take real action, both the U.S. and the rest of the world against China? This seems to be happening every week. We appreciate you coming on, Congressman Warren Davidson, and keeping us posted, as you always do. A big show.